Right, I've been saying I was going to do a motor update, so I worked on it some today. And, well, as you can see, oil pump and pickup are both mounted. I had to cut this off and re-weld it. I had to burr tool this out wider. I had to cut this stud down. By the way, in case anyone's wondering or wants to know, that stud is for, it's an ARP stud for oil pickup tube and girdle. There's the part number. There's the original stud. This stud is this, and then it tapers down to that 3 8 from like here up to the top of this bag. Like it was hella tall. Like it literally stood as tall as this bag. It was a lot of thread. It was rubbing on my oil pan right here. So I had to cut it down. Now, the other fun bit I have, this is a can pan. I'm assuming that's the part number, 15640. Made two years ago almost. Now, I've always heard of Canton being good product, but that is some nasty ass looking weld. I don't know who did this, but I mean, all the other welds are decent. And they're not pretty by any means, but that shit, that makes me want to go get my bird tool and go to town on this thing clean it up. I don't know if I'd ever be able to get all the metal shavings out of all these damn grooves and shit. I'd be scared of, the, of missing something. I'm pretty sure this is a magnetic uh, tip here. But one problem I am having. Oh, that's lovely. Brand new pan with rust in it. Just need to hurry up and get some oil in here. Anyways, one problem I am having is the girdle right here. I believe it's hitting on this, and it looks like I've already bent this in a little bit, pushing on it. Yeah, you can well, shit, I hold this damn thing still. So you can see there where it scraped some. It's hitting on this. I guess I'm gonna call Canton and ask him what the hell this little piece is. If anybody knows, comment away. The only thing I can figure is it's some kind of like a splash guard type deal, kind of like a, uh... shit, what the hell? What? Fuck this thing is. Still. Uh, what the frick are those things called that, uh, windage tray? I, I guess it's somewhat of a little miniature halfway windage tray. I'm not really sure but I don't know what it's really supposed to do. But I'm thinking I'm just gonna take a fucking hammer to it and bang it inward a little bit. Because it doesn't hit much, but it hits enough to throw the bolt holes off to where it doesn't want to bolt down. Now I still haven't torqued all this shit down. It's kind of in trial fit. The rods still have to be torqued. The mains have to be torqued. They're just kind of dug it down with the impact drill. But I mainly, all, all I was working on tonight was this pickup getting it ready um like i said if, not, if someone knows what the hell that little flange is for drop a comment if not call canton monday and ask him if how important that is or if i can hammer it out of the way um i mean my other option is take a grinder to this lip all the way down it and bevel it which i'd rather avoid but uh a neighbor propositioned me today I'll be doing some mechanic work for him. I'll be doing uh, brakes on a Corolla tomorrow, and then sometime during the week or next weekend, I'll be busting out an Accord head gasket. Hopefully, make some money to finish this project, not this motor, but the Mustang in general. But anyways, that's uh, that's the only progress I made with this today, for the most part. I started sandblasting my intake so I can get it powder coated. But anyways, that's it. Uh, PRW girdle, that part number. Canton oil pan, matching pickup. ARP everything. These uh, stainless studs for the oil pan are Canton. They're actually a damn good deal on Summit. If y'all wanna, if anyone wants to switch to studs for their 
oil pan. These are super cheap for what they are. Anyways, all right guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna bag this thing up and go inside. Been out here for a while, it's like 9.30 now. So. All right, later.